On 16th March, a man approached former beauty queen Riz Lo, dragged her to a pillar, pulled down her tube top, and grabbed one of her breasts. Riz was too shocked to react at the time, but there are things she and other women could do when faced with a similar situation. Okay, this is David, who is a self-defense instructor. So, David, can you tell me what should a girl do if something similar happens to her? All right. Okay, we will start from very simple where it actually happened. All right. Uh, the system we are about to introduce is called ballistic defense. So, Miss Lo was grabbed. Somewhere around the forearm, right? If I'm not mistaken. Okay. This is what we call in ballistic defense an anti-social act. Right? In most civilized societies, grabbing a woman the arm like that and being very forceful is an anti-social act. So we, be- we believe in ballistic defense that Newton's law says every action has an opposite and equal reaction. So the harder he grabs, my reaction will be right to the face. This is called a palm smash. Just open up your palms this way. You lift up. right, and So what will happen is that it would have ended the situation immediately. It would have given him an indication that you are taking this action very seriously. Right? Then there is a continuation. What do you do of the, of the lock now? Right? Or a grab. This is called a wrist grab. The best thing he did in your case was that he grabbed the forearm. And the forearm is a very difficult part of the hand to actually grab hold of. Because even me, I don't have such a big forearm. You can notice. It's very easily slipped away. Combine this and this together and just take a step back okay the last component to this entire uh, self-defense situation is basically the shout okay the japanese like to call this kia kia means shout of encouragement in our case in a self-defense situation is we shout so that we attract attention if i'm not mistaken on that day i don't think you were shouting very loud yes she was in a state of shock so what would happen if that if she just shouted out move back See, most people will watch. Singaporeans are very inquisitive. The reason he brought you to that corner is because he doesn't want anybody to see. Right? He wanted to use the pillar as a cover. It was actually a continuation, right? He dragged her from there, he dragged her over here. But if you had, if you had adequate number of hours in training in ballistic defense, the situation would have ended there. I'm pretty sure of it. So the same thing now, the opposite head. That's why he grabbed this hand, that was it. You can hear the sound, it's a wonderful sound. So as he's brought you here, first thing to do, I always tell, brace your neck, brace your neck and your head towards the wall. Why? Because if you stand this way, if he hits you, your face will smash right behind. This is going to cause you extreme hurt. So we always tell in our class that don't be afraid of the wall. A lot of people are afraid of the wall. So same thing over here. Once he grabs, right, you distract him by trying to pretend as if you are getting away. You see, I watch, I pretend. No! This doesn't work. We have the hammer fist. All you have to do is make your fist this way and right into the ball and s- the eyeball socket joint here. Bump. Could you tell me the distance? About, yeah. About this. Yeah. This yeah. Distance. So you were to lift your knee, you see? You can't reach his groin. Can you see that? You're quite far away. So this is the best. You see, your hand can reach the face. So the best attack is to actually hit the face. Face. See, it's quite a distance. His groin is quite a distance. I've got to go quite deep. Right? Okay, unless, unless you're really experienced and you pull him towards and then you knee him. Right? Shall we get Riz to also try out the moves? Okay. Yeah, sure. Shall we? Sorry. Okay. Yeah. yeah, saw that? Very simple. Yeah, okay, all you have to do. Okay, now you're going to do two it together. I want you to, as he grabs your hand, just lift up your hand, strike, and just shout. Let's see if you get. Yeah, you see, your hand comes out. My hand up. Just drop it, right? Imagine you're serving, huh? It's like a badminton serve. You're serving. So just relax. Shouldn't be stiff. Be very relaxed and just slam it out. Yes! Together, now the shout. I want you to shout. Perhaps it is because Riz is now better prepared, but she said the incident will not stop her from wearing revealing tube dresses. Find out why it's not a matter of once bitten, twice shy.